What's going on guys and welcome back. Today I am going to be talking about something that I think is pretty freaking cool and that is printing your photography. really funny is that over the years you accumulate things that are photography related or videography related regardless of if it's really tech or not. I've gotten maybe two or three of these as gifts and I've lost all three except for this one. Um, but I think it's hilarious that these just end up being gifts to you. Alright, so one of the reasons why I think it is very important to actually print your work is because it gives you something tangible in a very digital world. So actually being able to hold an actual printed photo, in my opinion, actually means a lot more than it would be to just show someone a photo on your computer or on your phone. Now yes, sometimes when you show those photos on your phone or your computer, they actually look a little bit crispier, a little bit sharper, and that's because the screens on phones and computers are gonna be higher resolution than a print. But at the same time, there's nothing like actually handing someone or showing someone a huge print, let's just say a 20 by 30 print of a photo that you really, really, really love and you think that other people would love too. And hanging that thing on the wall is just another experience and another really good feeling. Being able to actually hold that photo in your hand brings a whole new meaning to it. It's not just a photo that you scroll past when you're looking at it on Instagram or on Flickr or 500px, I believe it is. It's something that means more, and I think that's a very, very amazing feeling to have about a photo that you've taken, or even if you've bought a photo from a favorite artist or a favorite photographer that you really look up to or just really admire their work. Man, waking up early to try to get some of this done before I go to work. Not that it's tough, but man, I need some energy before, <laughs> before I wake up. Like, ugh. You could sell it. So you can open up a shop uh, like myself after this video is actually uploaded I'm making my website and my print shop through darkroom uh, actually live uh, So I'm actually going to be selling my prints and I think that is another reason why you should print them I know I said it before but I'm gonna say it again because I think it's another Just great reason is printing a photo in a large format regardless of what size it is if it's just 13 by 19 that I have up there if it's a 20 by 30 which I'll show you in a second it's just amazing having a photo of your own or someone else's printed it just looks different and I don't know if this is a little tip or not but um, from my experience that if you are going to be printing your work especially if you have your own photo printer Print and TIFF files, at least in my opinion, I feel like they come out better. Um, I mean, through a drop shipment type of program, I don't really know if you can upload a TIFF photo to the website because it may be too large. When I've printed JPEGs versus TIFF photos, I've always thought that the TIFF photos were able to come out a little bit cleaner and a little bit more pristine than a JPEG photo. Now, there's nothing wrong with doing either, it's just a personal opinion, maybe a little tip that you could potentially try yourself, especially if you have your own photo printer. But again, JPEGs work just as fine. Isn't that such a satisfying sound? I Probably not to the people that are listening to it, but to you drinking the coffee, mm, so good. No, I said I was gonna show you a 20 by 30 photo that I'm really proud of and I really love the photo because there's a really good meaning behind it, at least for me. And I think you guys would just appreciate it because it looks good. So let me go grab it. All right, so this photo right here is a 20 by 30 shot of the Lower Antelope Canyon in Page, Arizona. Uh, so this one, I'm sure you've seen plenty of photos like it, but one of the reasons why it's important to me is because it just has a lot of really good memories and I think it's an amazing looking photo. So I definitely think this is gonna be a great photo to put up on my print shop. And I think you guys would like it too, just because it would go well on your wall. And hey, 
Why not support your artists? We're struggling over here, We're struggling artists, starving artists. So definitely something that I think you should do. It's just an amazing feeling holding your photos versus just showing them on your phone. I don't know what it is, the tangible experience, the actual meaning behind the photo when you print it is just out of this world compared to just like, hey man, hey, look, look at my photo. Looks pretty dope, right? It's not the same. So guys, definitely print your work. I think you'll enjoy it. I definitely think it's worth it, even though it's a bit more expensive because yes, printing your own photos, the cost of paper, the cost of the printer, the cost of the ink, if you're having it shipped in, the shipping. I mean, there's a lot that goes into the price, but it's definitely worth it to have these photos. All right, and with all that being said, guys, that is gonna be it for me on today's video, making it kind of short and quick, just give you my reasons why I think that you should be printing your photos or any kind of art to be frank. But yeah, hope you guys like this one. Hope you guys have been doing well and comment, like, and subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next one. And before I forget, guys, if you do want to support me in my photography and in my adventures, I am launching my website today as this video goes out along with my print shop through Darkroom. And if you want to support me, please go over to that website, buy one of those prints and enjoy it on your wall. So catch you guys later.